You know, it's been weeks, but those ice bucket challenges to support ALS research are still sweeping the country. And tonight, a challenge everyone can do locally. Recently, we told you about the case of Seth Christensen, who four years ago was diagnosed with ALS, also known as Lou Gehrig's disease. Seth and his wife, Amy, launched a nonprofit organization and an internet radio show to support ALS sufferers around the country. Now, he's bringing that fight to Utah's Capitol Hill. I am Seth Christensen, and I challenge my dad, Alan Christensen, and the rest of the Utah State Senate. I also challenge Governor Mike Levitt. <laughs> Looks like that was a true family event. It'll be interesting to see what the legislature does with this one. You're watching a young soccer team get soaked, and it may be fun, but it doesn't compare to seeing what's going to happen to those Utah lawmakers and hundreds of others who are dunked. Christensen's challenge, in fact, will be answered by the legislature Tuesday, starting at 5.30 p.m. And not only that, you're invited to this. The information is on your screen, of course, and online. Organizers are saying that the first thousand people will receive ice provided by Associated Food Stores. The Salt Lake City Fire Department will have the water. Seth Christensen is hoping that Utah goes down to staging the largest ice bucket challenge yet.